Decision 2016 coverage, the latest NBC Wall Street journal, a journal, the poll showing that Hillary Clinton with a 10 point national lead over Donald Trump. Political analysts blame Trump's slide in part on recent accusations of sexual assault. As women step forward to accuse, WWT 6 News met with a former Miss Nebraska who says the candidate was nothing but cordial to her. I know so many young women that have competed in his pageants that have met him and had the exact same thing to say as me. Not all former Miss USA contestants have nice things to say about the man who once owned the pageant competition. And the first time it was just like a kind of a quick hug and a kiss on the lips and I was shocked just because I was like, what was that? I've never had anybody greet me like that. This former Miss Utah is one of seven women saying Trump has in some way sexually assaulted them. I don't know who these people are. I look on television. I think it's a disgusting thing. Trump denies the accusations. Stacey Santley says her interactions with the candidate were more than just kind. They were inspiring. But I was really fortunate to get to have a really meaningful conversation with him more than once. When she competed in 2002, her mother was very sick, battling cancer after going through final rounds of chemo. But she insisted on being there for her daughter. Santley says Trump was very kind to her and her family. He was there with an entourage of people, and if he, even if he wasn't, I still would have felt as comfortable. He was a complete gentleman and very respectful of us. He says he did come to the dressing rooms to visit with each girl, but only to say hi and welcome them. She admits after hearing the Access Hollywood tape, she was disappointed, but still trusts the man who had once been so nice to her. It's definitely a mistake that he made, but we are all human. We have all made mistakes. I don't think that was um, something that affects his ability to be a good president. Santley tells me she's not trying to sway anyone politically, but after seeing so many bad things about a man who had been so kind to her, she just wanted to share her own personal experience. All right, thank you, Don Grenice reporting.